Welcome to The Zone, I'm Gonçal. As you know, 2K yesterday released a short video in which they announced Mafia Trilogy, a compilation of the three Mafia games, Mafia, Mafia 2 and Mafia 3. So, in today's video I will explain how Mafia came about. Before I start, I want to say that all the games were published by Take-Two Interactive subsidiaries. Are you ready? Let's go! The development of the first Mafia began in 1998 it was codenamed Gangster and originally intended to be a driving game similar to Driver. In May 1999, Take-Two Interactive announced that he had acquired 55% of Gathering of Developers, a new publisher, and with that acquisition, Take-Two entered in several creative contracts, namely with Illusion Softworks. After launching Eden and Dangerous in 1999, the studio resumed work on Mafia. The release date was scheduled for 2000, but Illusion Softworks, which used the engine of Eden and Dangerous, replaced it by a new engine, as the previous one did not fulfill the developer's requirements. Due to the change of the engine, the game was released two years later than planned. On August 2002, we saw the release of Mafia. The game was really well received which currently holds a 88 on Metacritic. After the release, Illusion Softworks started working on a sequel, but was quickly put aside in favor of a sequel to Eden and Dangerous and a new title, Vietcong. In September of 2004, Take-Two announced a restructuring after submitting a weak fiscal report. Gathering of Developers was absorbed into Global Star Software, a publisher of budget games. In January of 2005, Take Two announced two new subsidiaries, 2K Games and 2K Sports. The company quickly started acquiring several studios, including Illusion Softworks in December of 2008. At the time of the acquisition, Take Two Interactive CEO Bob Iger announced that the sequel to The Mafia will be released in a span of years. On the same day, 2K announced that Illusion Softworks had been renamed to 2K Check. Finally, in August 2010, Mafia 2 was finally launched after 8 years in development. Shortly after the release of Mafia 2, its creator Daniel Vavra announced that he had left 2K Czech to found his own studio, leaving the Mafia franchise without a future again. Years passed and in January 2014, the studio in Prague was closed, with all its developers being transferred to Novato, and in December 2K announced the foundation of Anger 30. Led by Eden Blackman and award-winning William Bill Arms, the studio announced in August 2015 Mafia 3. The third title of the game, unlike the other two, pitted the protagonist against the Italian mob and focused on the meaning of the word family, thus connecting all games. In my opinion, the best story is found in this game, believe me, it is. Also in 2016, 2K Check became Anger 13, and yesterday we had the opportunity to see a short video that proved to be a possible remake of the first two games and the remaster of The Lost. According to several outlays, the first Mafia was created entirely from the beginning, through several screenshots, it was possible to observe a completely beautiful lost heaven, but we can wait for the official announcement of 2K on Tuesday, May the 19th. I hope you enjoyed this video and stay in the zone. Like this video and subscribe to the zone. Also, stay safe guys, this virus is very dangerous. Bye bye!